Bro, what happened? I'm literally just trying to do the uploads and tweet the match, and uh, Peko's out here losing his first off already. Uh, I'll be right with you guys. Give me one second. I did hear an Ivy Sword death, which makes me think, why are you Zar? I don't know. Uh, I, 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 I don't know. I don't necessarily think that I should be the one talking about it, but, like, uh, I really think that, like, regardless. Okay, get, nice, traps, traps the, uh, the jump with the up air. Uh, not traps it, but just catches it, catches it. trying to do like an aggressive landing and then ends up paying for it because of it. Bro, I think there is the false prophet, man. Don't listen to his siren song. You have to play Squirtle in neutral. You have to. <laughs> Stock from Luigi. Jesus. Oh boy. We what are we getting rid tummy. of? What are we getting rid of? FD and Smashville. Oh uh, yeah, I, I, mm hmm. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Big and small battlefield. What was the set count between helper and numbers? Was it game? I, was it not? Was it game four, John? Or was it, uh, I feel like it was game four, John. Yeah, yeah, Helper won game one, and John 3-0 from there. Oh no, the ball from across the screen. Three, two, one, go! Oh, Battlefield. I thought we were going to small Battlefield. I miss saw the, the selection. Okay. Uh, yeah, no, I can see this. Uh, I think this is a pretty good stage since you want to... Oh, the... Okay. Good spike. Yeah. Beefin has a, uh, has a good deal of, uh, variable. On like how she's gonna recover can make it a little bit difficult to like get those spikes. You like really need to force her and, and like uh, strain that recovery so that you can get the spike. Uh, like you're in definitely in a good position for it, but um, you can't just be like I'm up here. You need to you need to like take it from like an angle to, to force her into a direction. Now we're just trying to come back. Dash deck will do it even on battlefield. 190 after hit, laugh my ass off. Um, now, what is, uh, all right. You can get him off stage. All right, Ivy Sir, go Ivy Sir, yes. Good, now, mm, you had to jump off a little bit sooner and then just, like, jump off, do a retreating, like, jump. Like, jump off just to scare and then come back. You know, make them extinguish an option. Uh, all right. I would get off Ivysaur right now. Uh, okay. Uh, all right, now we're in. Okay, re-grab. There's a re-grab. Re-grab. Oh, that's... Really? No spike? Okay. All right. As your situation here. Uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know. Even at high percent, I would say, like, it, it's probably worth it to just, like, go Squirtle. Just because you have more potential uh, to, like, just win the exchange. It's not going to lead to the kill, but 
you know, win the exchange and then tag in for the kill, you know, because you're not going to get, like, the one-off. You know? she's, she's a very defensive player, you know, has a lot of stuff coming in. Like, it's hard to come in. Uh, that's probably it. Now it's Battlefield. Peko does not know what to do about the ball. Understandable. Plus, I mean, he's a big body. That's not going to hit the platform, but it might kill anyway. And it does. Peko taking the third stock of the, of the game. Ooh. Okay. All right, another two stock from Louis Jesus. My brother, please, just stay, Squirtle. Like, <laughs> we, play the neutral as the tiny, hard-to-hit character. I understand that Zard is kind of, you know, healing, but I don't know. Oh, switching to Diddy. Okay. Okay, so uh, Louis' bands were FD and Smashville. We're going around Small Battlefield, and Peko has counterpicked, swapped to Diddy. Uh, all right, so far, way better than what we were seeing before. Boom, boom. Not going to be the kill, but we're, we're getting there. Uh, we haven't seen any mu uh, much damage or much movement from Louis just because. Uh, I mean, Diddy's a fast character. Like, he's really good at overwhelming. And now we get the first stock for Peko. This is, the, I think, the first time we've seen first blood by Peko. Okay. You know, with how fast Diddy is, I imagine this is actually a pretty good matchup. Like you're you're setting the pacing, especially if you're out of plat uh, you're on stages with like just platform for like edge cancels and stuff like that. Like, wait, why? What what does Diddy need to do? What does Weefit need to do to make Diddy stop moving? You know? And, and yeah, this is this is black and white, uh, like super stark difference. Not playing Wii Fit's game anymore because you have just so many like good aerials. This is yeah, this is a really good change by Peko. Now can he make it back? My man is not paying attention to the ball like at all. Boom. All right, let's see how this edge guard goes. If you can keep him on the ledge and you just keep racking up on the damage, you are uh, doing what you need to. You don't need to get that kill. She's not. Uh, on stage to like go Kyle Cannon stuff. Oh, but we might have a turnaround. A reversal here. Nope. All right. That was kind of like a really scared roll. Uh, all right. Luigi is bringing it back. Boom. Ooh. Okay. I like that. Uh, great awareness because obviously this is just like a, a little bit of a scramble and it's just like a you know, good reaction uh, understanding that you did the spike into that border. But then also. Uh, Peko, uh, with really good off stage, making it count. Understand that the ball never stops having a goddamn hitbox. It is cursed in this game. Also, I just realized Luigi is playing John's color and is kind of messing with me now. All right. I like this. Yeah, good. Keep it, keep it slow. You don't need to force anything. Even if you're at 150%, like, don't worry about it. Also, yeah, I like that. Don't don't use the fact that you're at high percent as a reason not to use uh, barrels, because who cares? You're at a billion percent. A billion plus five, is, like, it doesn't matter. Okay, but can we block? Come on, man. Gotta, if you're going to walk into burst range, you got to be a little bit just... Uh, uh, Defensive. Don't walk into the burst rank where you can't react to that. The whole point of it, like, the reason why we fit will almost never, like, fully charge it is that she can always threaten it by keeping it out so that there is, like, no startup and it's just, like, whoosh. Like, look, yeah, that's the whole, like, she's commanding that whole spot. Ooh. All right. 
Uh, Luigi's, you know, bringing it back br uh, pretty okay, but this is still right now kind of Peko's game to lose. Let's see if he can uh, keep it. Uh oh, uh oh, the edge guard. This is Diddy's weakness. Oh, okay. Um, we don't know how to DI. We hold an out, probably. of FD and Kalos. Mm. Going to PS2. I think. Versus Wii Fit. Do you really want to get rid of FD and Kalos? He's not really a juggle character. Alright. I blinked. Alright, now we have a super big lead uh, for Peko starting out this game four. Looking for that spike. Oh, Alright, let's see. Are the barrels going to do something wacky? No, they're gone. They weren't gone! <laughs> Oh, are we going for the multi-level marketing? Does Pekka know how to do that stuff? Ooh, I like that. Oh, nice! Most cities would have been dead from um, from that. So really good stuff for Pekka by able to make making it back and like waiting just long enough so that you don't get like the you know you just keep what is it when you do barrel charge too early. Uh, you maintain the momentum that you were at, but if you wait a moment, then you let him slow down, then he'll actually do the stall, which means he'll be able to build up far more uh, distance. All right, Pekka with a two-stock lead. Okay. All right. Literally standing dead center, shield banana in hand. Love to see it. This is how you play to your advantage. Yes, boom, boom. Are we sure this is a bad matchup for Diddy? Are we sure? When exerting yourself, remember to keep breathing. <laughs> you gotta keep breathing. Three stock? Three stock. So, still getting rid of FD and Kalos. Going to town. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if that's necessarily a good idea versus Diddy. Uh, Diddy's off stage game, very horizontal. So, like, the closer blast zones could end up helping. Although, taller ceiling, and that last stock was taken from up smash. Uh, what's, that's what's really nice about uh, this stage, like the Animal Crossing stages in general, like the taller ceiling. Um, you know, you, you might be able to get like one or two extra interactions out of it. Oh my. Okay, yeah, no. Yeah, again, like the, 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 the same thing applies. Like when you're ever trying to, to, to spike we fit. Oh my god, Pickle just went so forward. I gotta fix that camera. Uh, it, like when it comes to like spiking her, it's just like. If she has like the whole distance to like bury like left and right, like you, you you have to do something else in addition to just throwing out the spike. It's just gonna be so hard to land it. All right, neck and neck. This is the first time uh, that they're playing this matchup starting on even footing because honestly, Peko got like super early kills both times. Ooh, but once again, first blood goes to Peko. Nice spike, fantastic. Damn. Mmm. That's how you push advantage. All right. Two stocks to one. Peko in winner's finals? <laughs> Winner. He's going to have to fight uh, John. 
we're gonna see. I wonder if he'll stay Diddy uh, if he beats Louis to fight John. Or will we see a comeback and will we see the Wii Fit Mirror? Um, I might as well go off air for that. Huh? I like that. Great! That was great pressure. Even though it didn't amount to anything, like, you know, it didn't come to something anything tangible, that was just like exerting so much pressure. That was fantastic uh, positioning uh, from Peko. And, and great awareness by Louis to make sure that it diffused to nothing. Uh, but like, you know, you had to play that game. Whoa, careful. I don't know who you're grabbing. That character be moving. Okay, I think we're going a little bit too ham for the spikes, but I do like the energy for that. You know, you do want to keep that stuff like, you want to keep threatening it so that they have like, hmm. well, actually no. Cause like if you give it a rest, if you give it a rest, then like they can forget about it potentially. And then you can bring it back out. Uh, but like we've just seen like going for it like over and over and over again. So like he's constantly aware of it. He's constantly going to like try and respect it. Even though, e even though that Luigi's been like, you know, supposedly aware and respecting it, still kind of working against him. Uh, but you know, bringing it back, this is last stock. Pretty big percent lead, but Kaioken is on right now. Uh oh, uh oh, this is where Diddy dies. Anytime Diddy is off stage. It, it, it doesn't matter what percentage he's at, could die. Okay, edge guard situation for Peko. Let's see. Ooh, banana. All right, we just don't know how to. It's the eye back. Yeah, I mean, the banana. Always a great setup for basically just hit confirming. Here it comes. Calls the jump. And he was holding. And hence. The whoosh this direction well he wasn't holding that direction but like he was like holding down or out. i mean he went really fast so yeah because remember the 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 di line isn't like the direction you held but rather the um the the result of what you were holding so like we probably would would have wanted to see a more steeper angle rather than uh something like that because uh you know it's a it's a soccer angle, so like the higher percent, you know, you're gonna go super high. That was so sick. Let's see that again. Like this is great pressure. The fact that this was an edge guard situation for Louis Jesus uh, to like try and kill Peko, and then Peko completely turned it around. Hold on. Look how fucking close. Look how close that banana did. Like he tossed it. And he still didn't get touched by it. Was that, like, was it because of the hurtbox shift? Like, he was going through the platform. So, like, I think his hitbox is, like, his hurtbox is still, like, up here or whatever. But then, yeah, and then just, like, moves up because of the down air. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that spike is super strong. Uh, yeah, so good stuff to Peko. Uh, making it to Winner's Finals, Game 5 over uh, Louis Jesus. Going to be fighting John Numbers in Winner's Finals. Uh, next up, 